This is Dr. Andrew Jones. In this edition of Veterinary Secrets, I'm going to be discussing the disturbing chicken abuse video. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. Today's video is definitely a disturbing topic and what it's come about is recently in the area where I live, in British Columbia, Canada, there was a video released where there was a group called Mercy for Animals, an animal rights organization, who put cameras on uh, an employee and were actually recording what was happening uh, with chickens that were being caught uh, in a farm, a big chicken farm in the lower mainland. So just one of the suburbs of Vancouver, so not super far from where I live. Um, this all happens, either these are factory farm chickens and you know these big uh, closed in warehouses, you know, no outside, no one from the outside can see what's going on in there. And in part it sort of shed a light on what's really going on within the whole chicken industry. Um, but in particular, I mean this is just so, so disturbing. So I'm just going to show you some small clips that they released from this video. Um, you know, just be warned, there's some pretty graphic stuff, and then I want to go ahead, and go ahead and talk a little bit about it. First, super disturbing, and like just to watch those. I mean, I mean, I find it difficult to watch, um, as probably you do as well. Um, two, it looks like some of those individuals are going to be charged. Um, in in BC now, we have some pretty strong fines that could be levied against these individuals, up to seventy five thousand dollar fines, and up to five years in jail uh, for animal punishment or animal cruelty. So. And hopefully that happens. And do they deserve that? Rightfully so. Do they ever? And I mean, I don't know what's going to be the outcome of this case. If they're going to be charged, and you know what actual fines, and if they're actually going to get any jail time. But I hope hope they do. And definitely, I'll keep you informed, you know, as to what happens. Second, this just sheds a, sheds a light on you know what's happening within the whole. Um, factory farming world, uh, and in particular within the chicken industry. Now they're saying it's the animal, the single biggest farmed animal uh, worldwide. There's over 30 billion chickens being raised and not that many slaughtered every year. Um, you know, varying degrees of regulation. It's really done in these sort of, you know, these big huge factories, these big closed walls. No one gets to really see what's going on. And you can sort of see the type of people who might be attracted to that. I mean, pretty low paying, pretty callous people, they could, you know, they could care less. Um, never mind the fact we're still allowing, you know, hundreds of millions of chickens to be raised in these tiny confined spaces um, with, you know, less than adequate ventilation, virtually no space, you know, being fed a diet that's not really appropriate for them. And it's just all about, you know, either getting them to gain weight, getting them to produce more eggs, you know, in the fastest period of time. We're not really concerned about their welfare. We're not really concerned about their health. It's all about production. I mean, how can we get, you know, the most eggs, the most meat in the shortest period of time that's gonna cost us the less, you know, and mass produce this, produce more and more and more in a big factory way. Chickens are pretty neat. I mean, they're pretty thoughtful, inquisitive animals. I don't know if you spend any time around chickens, but they're not, yeah. They're really interesting animals, and they don't deserve to have hundreds of millions, billions of chickens being factory farmed. I mean, and it's all for the to supply, you know, our you know seven billion people, and so many of us that are still eating meat. We're wanting to eat like cheap meat. So next time you're going to a grocery store and you see like, there's that super cheap chicken. There's a reason why it's cheap. 
it's, be, it's because it's being factory farmed and they're being factory produced. And it's all about volume and it's all about increasing profit and margins. It's not about the welfare of those animals. You know, I'm guilty uh, as the rest in terms of, you know, trying to save some money and sure enough, I'll buy that cheap stuff. But you know, especially after watching this video, definitely making me think twice, uh, making more of an effort of, I'm, as I'm still on the media, we're buying chicken that's at least ethically raised. So that, you know, they, they are free range. They've had a bit of a, a quality of life uh, as opposed to just being raised in a factory. And with all our animals, and especially our farm animals that are raised period, I mean, I, I just want all of you, you know, including myself, to really be thinking about, you know, where is this egg coming from? You know, where is this, where is, how has this animal been raised? How have they been treated to get there? And um, when you're making that purchase, like just being much more thought, thoughtful around being a consumer and, you know, really thinking about the animals in that way. And, and I know, like, most of the world, if, if they could see that connection, I mean, here's these chickens being abused in this horrible way, and you know, here's this cheap meat, they'd probably stop eating it, they sure wouldn't buy it. Again, you guys were watching this video, yeah, that it was definitely disturbing uh, to see those scenes, and I really do hope those those people are punished appropriately, so they're given a maximum fine, they're, they're going to jail, and there's a real strong message sent. And secondly, I hope you do some reflecting yourselves, as well I, around, you know, how we're raising animals in the first place and the choices that we're making and how we can affect that.